abs workout. This workout is gonna work your core, especially your low abs area. There's eight brand new episodes in this program and the full daily schedule is on my website. If you're looking for meal ideas, I've also launched a new recipe section to help you out. And remember guys, you're not alone in this journey. Do share your progress with the rest of the community on YouTube, Instagram, or join my Discord server if you want more support. A quick shout out to VS Pink who's sponsoring today's video. I'm wearing this seamless set and as guys know, I love the pastel range. So links to the outfits are down in the description box. And yeah, it's time to smash that like button and let's get started. We've got 14 exercises today, 30 seconds on and 5 to 10 seconds off. Let's start the workout on your mat with leg drop seizures. Start with your legs lifted and have your chest lifted a little using your core muscles, then lower your legs down slowly. Cross your legs like scissors twice, then bring it back up and repeat. Make sure your back is flat on the mat, if not, you'll injure your lower back. You can crunch up a little to help with that. For an easier alternative, just don't drop your legs too low. Alright, no rest here, stay on your mat and we've got hip lift pulses. Lift your hips using your lower abs, just little lifts and don't swing your legs. Do it controlled and remember to use your abs instead of your arms to lift your hips up. Nice work guys, 10 seconds rest here. Get ready to go into a high plank position for some plank swipes on the left leg. Bring your left leg as close to your left elbow as possible, then swipe to the other side, then back to the left, then extend and repeat. Remember to draw in your belly and engage your core. And on to the other side. Keep pushing guys, you can do it. You're doing well guys, now lay flat on the mat and we've got elbow to knee crunch. Crunch up while bringing your legs in and try to touch your knee with your elbows. Then extend out and repeat. Make sure your back is flat on the mat too. It's getting to my head. One look in the mirror, don't like what I find. I know that somewhere in there there's a good guy. But he runs away. I'm sorry that I stole your car and got those tattoos on Just a quick 5 seconds rest and we are going straight into low bow in and out. Don't let your shoulders blade touch the mat, gaze forward and now bring your legs in and out. Use your core muscles for this, keep pushing. We've got reverse crunch next. Remember, you can always do the alternatives if you need to, just don't give up. Have your legs bent and now lift your hips off the mat and bring your knees towards your chest. Make sure you're using your core muscles instead of your back or your arms. If this is too hard, then try the easier alternative. Just do a smaller range of motion lifting your hips up. Stay where you are and we've got flutters next. 
Crunch up a little using your core muscles so your shoulder blades are not resting on the mat, then flutter your legs. Remember to use your core muscles, your abs should be burning. And also please make sure your lower back is flat on the mat. For the easier alternative, you can always rest your head on the mat and also don't lower your legs as low. We've passed the halfway mark, so don't quit now. Alright, now flip around and get into a high plank position and we're doing some cross body climbers. Bring one leg across to the opposite elbow and do the same on the other side. Work that core, guys. You can do it. No rest here, we're going straight into plank jumps. Jump both legs in and then out into a high plank. This works the entire core and the lower abs. For low impact, just bring one leg in one at a time, then back out. Make sure your knees don't touch the mat. Just four more exercises to go, guys. You can do this. We all have a past that we can change, eh? Things we've done that maybe we could hate, eh? We all feel the same, just a little shame. But it'll be okay. Now get on your butt and we're doing up and over. Have your knees bent, then bring both legs to one side. Then bring over like a rainbow to the other side. Engage your core, guys. If you need to take a little break, it's okay. Take it, because you need to do it in good form to not injure your lower back. No rest here, we're going straight into single leg to elbow tap. Crunch up a little the entire time so you're engaging your upper abs the whole time. Then touch your knee or your thigh with the opposite elbow. This is slightly more challenging than bicycle crunches, but you can do it. Keep a slight bend on your knees if your hamstring is tight. Ten seconds rest here, and now we've got two more exercises to go. Sit on your butt, and we've got leg lift and extend. Have one knee bent and back straight, and now extend the other leg out. Then lift it up, lower it down, and back in. Then repeat. Make sure you engage your core here, and that your back stays neutral. For the easier alternative, just leave out the leg lift. No rest here, we're going straight onto the other leg. And let's wrap up this workout. Synthetic tabs, I stare at the sun, I look at the moon, I look at the stars, I search for a sign to get rid of these scars, yeah, still not living large, you bringing back energy, send my regards, I'm really from nothing, I'm beating the odds, yeah, you. And that's the workout guys, you have done well for completing this. Shout out to VS Pink for sponsoring today's outfit, smash that like button for me and leave a comment down below and I'll see you in the next workout. Bye! I won't switch up, girl don't leave, bring it on back to me.